Yikes, maybe that's harmless, but we have learned tonight that more of Riverside may be contaminated. City officials, along with the EPA, just explained the new boundaries for that contaminated area to folks here at Stebbins High School. There are two chemicals, PCE and TCE from industrial solvents that have been found in the groundwater and soil gas in this neighborhood. And now the area of concern has grown from 184 homes to 365 after a first phase of vapor intrusion testing. We've not only seen it um, move horizontally farther uh, than it first anticipated back in December, which I mean farther to the southwest in the neighborhood, but we've seen elevated levels in the last six months, higher levels of the chemicals below the house and in the indoor air, and we addressed that tonight. It's definitely going to hurt property values. I mean, a lot of people are going to be concerned about living in this area if they can't be able to get this cleaned up in a reasonable time. Well, Tim, I wish they could, but the EPA says the contamination could take 10 years to clean up. They plan to continue testing.